So, Minister, tell us about this new deal you've just negotiated. Yes, I'm delighted to announce that the UK will soon be a member of the CPTPP. And that stands for the Comprehensive and Progressive Agreement for Trans-Pacific Partnership. Yes, the CTPTP is a great opportunity for this country to join a vibrant trading bloc just a few thousand miles away. What is the benefit of joining this compared to being in the EU? Well, for one thing, it doesn't involve the French. Government figures suggest that joining this bloc will increase the UK's GDP by around 0.08% whereas the effects of Brexit are estimated at around minus 4%. Will you please stop going on about Brexit? It's embarrassing. We've left the EU and now we're committing to the CBGBs. I mean, for goodness sake, it's like being at a wedding with somebody who can't stop going on about the ex-wife. But you have to admit that those numbers are pretty stark. Look, 0.08% is an old number. It's from a prediction made years ago. So what is the new number? That's relevant. The point is that it could be potentially anything. All we have to do is believe hard enough. So you're not saying that this makes up for Brexit. We have to accept that Brexit is in the past. It's part of our history, which means we should build a statue of it, then forget it ever happened. Indeed, some people are saying that this deal could actually prevent the UK from ever getting back into the EU. I'm not saying that's why we're doing it, but it's not not why we're doing it, let's put it like that. But if we left the EU, surely at some point in the future we could just leave this. Well, not without a referendum, and no one wants another one of those. So why aren't we having a referendum on this deal? Sorry, what? If it's such a big deal, why don't the people get to vote? The difference is that this deal won't affect immigration, so there's no way to make any campaign about that. So what's the point? This deal only involves 11 countries, doesn't it? Yes, but that's the beauty of C3PO. Other countries will be joining after us. Uh, think of it like a startup. They're Facebook and we're Justin Timberlake, coming along at just the right moment to save everybody. I'm not sure that's actually what And happened. then they'll probably be so grateful that we arrived that they'll appoint us as the king of the CBGBs and we'll have a sort of empire back at last. Minister? Maybe they'll put up a statue of me. Thank you, Minister. Next up, as Donald Trump becomes the first former president to be charged with a crime, we ask, is this the first instance in recorded history of a witch hunt finding an actual witch? And later we'll be speaking to an American commentator who'll say that this will simply increase his appeal among Republican voters, because they love a bad boy, and in the end, they just want to be hurt.